And today I am going to be doing a clothing haul because I figured the last time I did any clothing shopping was just before my holiday to Mykonos. So I kind of feel like it's about time. I'm just going to tell myself that even though we both know it's just because I wanted to have a splurge for clothes. Both of these were online purchases. One was Topshop. I do have a Topshop in Brighton, but I've been really busy, so this was more of like a late night, just throw some things in the basket and see what they look like kind of thing. And the other was ASOS because I just love ASOS. It has everything. It has everything. So, I'll start with Topshop stuff. First thing I picked up was this metallic crop top. I really like this. I like how like zhuzhy it feels. It is kind of that fabric though that could itch on your skin, so I don't know. Um, but I thought it would be really lovely with a pencil skirt or with something like these, which are also trousers that I picked up. Um, and I just, I don't know, I just, I love both of these. I've now gone, I'm showing you two things at the same time. I'm not good at this. Yes, jumper, really cute. Little crop sleeves, cropped top. Would have to wear something underneath it because it could be quite see-through, but I just thought that that was quite nice. Especially for that time where summer ends and autumn starts to begin because it's not necessarily really cold but there's a bit of breeze, I don't know. English summer is very unpredictable anyway so having things like that is actually quite useful. Trousers! I just love patterned trousers which is a sentence I never thought I would say because I don't know, I feel like it's just not something that you would generally ever be like, oh, pattern trousers, yes. But I really like them because I like to wear things that are quite basic on top sometimes. And then it's quite nice to kind of inject a bit of fun into your outfit on your legs rather than on the top. Um, so yeah, I picked up these, which I think are extremely cute. Very kind of 70s colours again. I did get a pair like this, similar to this with sunflowers on, which I have been wearing a lot, which is why I knew I would really like these. They are kind of, they're cigarette trousers, so they kind of brush your ankle, or you can roll them up a little bit, which sometimes I do do because I feel like I don't know whether the cigarette trousers kind of lengthwise suit me. So I tend to roll them up a little bit just until I feel like it looks okay. Um, but yeah, I really, really like these, so most excite. I also think they would be really nice for autumn too because they're not, you know, necessarily bright summery colours. This next thing, um, I've seen a few people wear these um, and Poppy, who is Alfie's sister, had one on holiday and since then I've just noticed everyone wearing them and I'm like, I wonder if I could pull those off. I'm not sure. I know I can rock a jumpsuit and I feel quite comfortable in a jumpsuit and I have many of those in my wardrobe but this is kind of like a take on it but not, I'm not too sure what they're actually called, um, but it's this gorgeous like silky flowery pattern um, and the back is very pretty actually, it looks like that. And then you've got little buttons down the front and it's kind of, it cuts off I guess just below the knee. Um, so I'm interested to see if these suit me, they also have pockets which is a massive bonus. Um, but I just thought this one was so pretty and because it has been quite muggy um, and warm here this is the sort of thing that you could throw on and feel like you're still you know covered up but it's so floaty that you wouldn't get too hot um, so I thought this would be perfect and it's just so pretty so hopefully I don't look like I'm wearing a jumpsuit that shrunk in the wash that's what I'm kind of scared of the other thing I have really been loving recently are dungarees. I have two pairs of dungarees. These ones are black and they are shorts, so they come to, you know, just below the bottom region. And I also have a three quarter length pair that you kind of roll up in actual denim, like denim color, blue denim. That's the one, blue denim. Yeah, I just really like them. I thought I would feel like a nine year old, like, I used to wear dungarees all the time, but I really don't. I just feel very, I don't know, they're very comfy. And I feel like it makes an outfit look really well put together, even though you've just got a t-shirt and thrown something on top. But I don't know, I really like them. Let me know what you think of dungarees. Anyway, because I really like them, I thought, do you know what, I'm gonna try another kind of dungarees variation. So I've gotten for patterned. This is woodland theme 
It's so cute and it has the clips. I used to have dungarees with these on, like the little crocodile clips. Um, and then you've got zips down the side. And yeah, I just thought that would be really nice with a gray top or a white top. And again, it's three quarter length. The last thing I got from Topshop was a jumper. It's not a super thick jumper, but it's the sort of jumper that you would throw on in the evening time. And it is this, it's like black ombre. So it goes from black to gray and it's just so soft. It's so lovely. I really like Topshop jumpers. I feel like they have good like flow in them. Um, I don't know if that makes sense. Like they just move nicely. They feel nice on um, and I feel like this is gonna be a really nice one. Plus it's monochrome, so you can't really go wrong. But yeah, I really like this. Next up is, oh wait, one more thing from Topshop. This isn't really clothing, but I picked it up anyway. It's a phone case that says Pizza Queen and it has little pictures of pizza on it. I don't know, I saw this and I was like, this sums me up pretty much. I should probably get this for my phone because I am a pizza queen. I really like skinny dip phone cases, so hurrah! Next up is ASOS. Now, I did go a bit shoe crazy on ASOS, so I'll do those last. <laughs> to start with, I picked up this, oh, which is a Snow White jumper. It just has embroidery on it. Um, it's actually Disney and 11 Paris. So I just thought that was quite nice. Makes a plain jumper a little bit more interesting and I love Disney, so. Not sure why Snow White doesn't have any eyes. It looks kind of creepy, but I mean, Snow White can't really look creepy, can she? The dwarfs, however, well. The next thing I picked up is this Wild Fox t-shirt. I really like Wild Fox t-shirts because they're really good quality and they feel very lovely on. It's so soft and I just love the little cat face on it. I just thought it was so cute. So I'm very excited to try that. I got this Mason Scotch shirt, which has tiny little raindrops on, which I thought was really, really lovely. Um, it just feels lovely and soft as well. Um, and I do love a good shirt, as you know. And this one was just very nice. Very, very nice indeed. Okay, and then the last two things are just two tops. One of them says, vlogging over jogging, which I thought was quite funny, quite apt, although it should be vlogging really. And the last one is a little stripy t-shirt that just says 1975 and it's kind of cropped, but yeah, I just like it. These all have a kind of theme of things stuck to the front. <laughs> um, so I first found these and I was like, oh my goodness, these are the cutest things ever. They're tiny little like eyelashes with ears. I don't know if you can see that, there you go. There's the ears, um, and the ears can kind of stick up. They're just so cute. I don't know if they're supposed to be mice. I think they're mice, or cats, yeah. Mm, cats, no, mice maybe, yes. Um, so I just thought they would be really nice. At the moment, it's the kind of weather which is quite warm, but you don't necessarily want to pair a smart outfit with sandals. The other day I had a meeting and I had a lovely outfit on, and I just didn't really have a lot of like smart flats, which is where I kind of thought these would be quite nice because they're smart, but they're also fun. Um, and they could be worn casually and formally, which is why I liked them. I also really like the little pointed, the pointedness, which I think makes them feel a little bit more formal. So I got those, which were just ASOS, which then led me on to finding these, which are also, I think these ones are cats, or maybe they are mice, I'm not sure. Um, and it has a tiny little peep toe, so if you had like red nails, it would look like a little red nose, which I think is so cute. And these are Melissa shoes. I actually already own a pair of Melissa shoes and they are so comfortable, so I knew I would absolutely love these. Um, I just hope I don't spike anyone with the ears. They're not like sharp, but they're definitely sturdy. Um, if you were to kick someone in the head with these, you would leave a bit of a mark, thankfully. I don't do that as a rule in life, so I should be fine. They're just so cute. Oh, I'm guessing they are cats since it says meow inside. Makes sense. And again, I just thought they would be really good for casual or formal. And then the last pair, I was feeling kind of brave and I was like, do I, don't I, am I gonna wear these? I don't know, I just really like them. They're so fun. And it is these, which are just ASOS, and they're white, but they have like, not emojis, but almost um, little square, Emoji, so you've got smiley on one side and then really unhappy and crying on the other. 
and I just really liked these. I thought with a pair of black skinny jeans and a nice t-shirt or a shirt maybe at an event or something, it's just a really nice alternative to smart heels is to have something like this, which I think are smart looking, but also very fun. Um, so I'm actually really glad I got these because then it's an out of stock and I was like, oh no, they've gone. And I was like, wait, I got the last pair. So, and the last pair was a three. So I just feel like that they were destined. And I did try them on and I actually really, really liked them. They're really cool. So I'm very happy with my purchases. That is pretty much everything I got from Topshop and ASOS or ASOS. I never know how to pronounce it. Is it ASOS? Is it ASOS? Is it ASOS? I just don't know. Thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And let me know in the comments which one of these things you love the most. Love you very much and I'll see you again soon.